Hello humans, how are you today? Doing pretty dandy myself. Sorry about the delay in videos. I've been crazy, crazy busy last week, but I will be getting right back on the schedule. So today's video, we have obviously something we haven't done in a little while. It's where we ask the question, is it what? And then obviously we have some other content coming next week. So today's video, we're gonna be testing out the Anthro Desk, Anthro Desk Standing Desk Converter. It's a little bit of a um, tongue twister and they refer to it just as their standing desk. So what it does basically from what I've seen is it's a desk that you can either just kind of have laid out on, on a tabletop or something along those lines, or uh, it converts up and down to you know different uh, levels that you need. Uh, their entire thing is about you know, obviously gaming enhancements uh, or enhance your gaming, however you want to say it, I guess. Um, it's supposed to reduce back pain so you have proper posture, different things like that. Uh, we also have their Ergo, uh, Ergo Slant Anti-Fatigue Mat as well, so we're going to try both of those out. We'll have all the links in the description so you can actually go and get the products if you like them. So uh, I'm going to go downstairs and show you guys the giant box that this came in, and then uh, we'll go from there. All right, sorry about the crappy lighting. Oh, there's a little sexy Luna Chan coming in taking a look. So anyways, uh, this is the actual desk here. It is really, really heavy. Uh, I'm gonna put it together and uh, obviously we're gonna rate it from there, but I, uh, I'm pretty excited to use it. That's the anti-fatigue mat right there. Um, I already stepped on it, it feels amazing on your feet. So I'm gonna go ahead and start putting this bad boy together and we're gonna go from there. She agrees. Okay, so there wasn't a lot of assembly that I thought actually. There's uh, just a couple of parts here. You have this right here, which is like the, the pull-out section. And then you have the actual, this thing's heavy. Giant, oh, that's not, not a good view, is it? Oh, there we are. This is uh, the actual thing as well. So let me back up a little bit for you. You guys can get a look at it. You can kind of see it. All right, so we got it put together. It was pretty simple. I mean, it was kind of a pain in the butt, actually, but it was simple to do, just the placement where the screws are kind of weird. So I'm gonna try to show you guys a little bit how it works. So as they tell you here, you just gotta press the lever to make it adjust, so. You can see I already did that. And now, it has gone up. Not too shabby, right? And then let's see if we can go ahead and put it down. Now you guys can't see it until I back up, of course. All right. Obviously you would use this on like, you know, your dining room table or coffee table, etc. And then if you want it not put on that or you want a little bit higher, you basically can have it right here. Maybe sit pretzel style on your floor. Have a little lunch on there, laptop, work, etc. It's got a place for your uh, monitor on top, and then or an iPad slot right there, different handles, etc. So let's uh, get back in and uh, we'll uh, review it, shall we? Alrighty, and we're back. So that's a pretty cool product, actually, but you don't really care if it's cool. You want to know if. This is what I think. Depends on your budget. So yes and no. This product is not cheap. Uh, I will run you around $200. So it's not a cheap product at all. If you have the budget, it is a very, very high quality product. So it's worth it if you have the budget. If you're, you know, living paycheck to paycheck and having McDonald's or whatever, and you know, nothing wrong with McDonald's, but you know, we all know the dollar menu is kind of cheap. You might not be able to get this because it's a little it's a little pricier. You might have to save it up or ask for a Christmas present or a birthday or whatever. So I would rank this product an eight out of ten. Um, the construction of it is crazy good. It's very, very heavy duty. It uh, was actually kind of heavy to lift and whatnot. So that's one thing I'll tell you about. Um, it's it's got, I love the ascending and descending. So that if you're on the floor and you want to play on your computer, because sometimes you know how it is. I'll I'll be on the floor. Well, you might be on the floor, or some people might be on the floor, and you're watching your show and you want you want to be on the computer. You don't want it on your balls because you'll end up you know frying your babies. So you want to have a have a laptop table, and that's perfect. You can kind of fit right under there, or you can just put it right on the table itself. So what did I not like about it? Um, it's bigger than I thought it would be. So I'm not gonna. I was hoping to use this. 
but I'm not gonna put it on my coffee table because it'll take up most of my coffee table. And the top is made of glass, so one screw up and I'll break another tabletop, uh, don't ask. But, um, yeah, so that's one area where I don't like it, and the second part was, um, I really didn't like putting it together, it was really a pain in the butt, that one piece took forever, because the way the screws are, and how you can't even get the freaking screwdriver in, although they give you a little handy dandy one, so that's quite kind of them. Uh, so yeah, I mean, then the price tag is a wee bit high, not for the product itself, but for many budgets. Other than that, though, I do highly recommend the product if you have it in your budget. It's really awesome. Um, I, I'm not sure where I'm going to put it or what I'm going to do with it yet because I can't put it on my table. It's too big, but I'm going to put it somewhere because I actually definitely really like it. So, anyways, I hope you guys all enjoyed this video. I'll put links in the description so you can buy it as well. Their Ergo mat, there's really not much to show you. It is a anti-fatigue mat, and you stand on it. I'm not going to have you waste your time looking at me standing on a fatigue mat, but... It is one of the nicest fatigue mats I've ever stood on, and I've you know stood in many offices and, and, and whatnot. So I would give it um, clearly a 10 out of 10 for this fatigue mat. I mean, I obviously you gotta know how long it'll last. Who knows if it'll last a long time, but the way it feels on my feet is perfect. So I believe that was around $40, 30 or $40. I'll put that in the description as well. But anyways, um, so this Thursday, sh or either this Thursday or next Sunday is going to be another Munch Pack unboxing. Got a couple of those bad boys to do. Uh, some more Is It Worth It? So maybe some keto uh, information as well. But I hope you guys all enjoyed the video. So thank you all for liking, commenting, and subscribing. And I will see you all next week, meow. Or actually next Thursday. <laughs> see ya.